Running back, Jaheim White. Questions for Jaheim? Greg? So, Jaheim, is he You've been getting better and better, but did you have a feeling that the progress is there? And did you have a feeling coming in today you were ready for even a bigger breakout? Uh, yeah, just because my preparation at practice, um, being consistent and uh, going 100%, you know, every day at practice. And uh, yeah. Specifically today for you that worked so well. So just specifically today, what worked so well for you? To be honest, I feel like everything, but like, I mean, I didn't get in the box, so that's the only thing that really, you know what I'm saying, messed it up. How did it feel to get 16 carries to really get in a rhythm and, and show these fans what you're capable of? Oh, uh, it felt great. It felt real great. High school, you know, I had like 22 carries a game and all that, but uh, getting the 16 carries in college football, you know what I'm saying, it's, it's great. I feel good. Part of your mentality, because it looked like some of the runs you were really trying to break it to get maybe into the end zone and mm -hmm. make them as deep. Is that your mentality to try to drag it as long as possible? And how were you able to do that maybe in this game? I mean, I, I mean that's just the action, like my reaction, you know, seeing it, trying to go score every time I get the ball. Yeah. It seems like with your skill sets, you and CJ are a really good duo. Um, how far do you think that backfield can go this season? Oh, uh, we can go real far. Like, our whole room is just talented, so, yeah, real far. See, on that outside zone and, and the toss and those things, what, what do you look for there? Well, I look at the free safety. You know, I see, like, if the free safety go, you know what I'm saying, on the other side of the field, then it's a home run. Like, I know my, my receiver's going to hold the blocks for me. All I got to do is just, you know what I'm saying, progress and just go. It looked like the line did a really good job setting the edge pretty much all game. Yeah, yeah. How, how, how easy does that make those outside runs when you're really not getting touched? Until yeah, you they make it feel real easy. Like, that old line, they're really good. You know what I'm saying? They put a lot of work in what they do. Um, and, yeah, like. Is there any significance in the number 22? There's a pretty good WVU running back all the time leading rush for what's saying. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Did you and CJ or any of the other backs have any conversation on the sideline about, hey, I, I saw this hole or I saw this and I can get going just in particular with this game since you yeah. both had real great games, obviously? Yeah, we always talk about, like, once we come to the sideline and we sit down, uh, we always talk about, like, what we see out there and we just, you know what I'm saying, just go Maybe back and forth with it. Maybe that was discussed. That oh, no, no, no. Is there any way you can describe, like, if somebody who hasn't seen you before, the running styles, maybe similarities or differences between you and CJ? Because it seems like you're a little bit of lightning where you just get that burst where CJ wants to be the thunder or the guy who just blows through holes. I mean, yeah, what do yeah you I'm, the, I'm the more ex explosive, the uh, scat back. That's what they call me. And the, the whole team called me the scat back. Uh, CJ is just like more of the downhill runner. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. You excited about next week? I mean, that's, you know, cool atmosphere, environment to play in. Yeah, yeah, I'm very excited. Yeah, I can't wait. You did play at Penn State, right? You, you did. Did you get into that game? No. Nah. So, I mean, this will be the biggest environment you will play in. Obviously. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> so. I mean, you know, season high for you tonight. I mean, you look pretty calm about it. Uh, are you going to celebrate for 24 hours, or what are you going to do? Nah, I mean, like, I've been waiting for this moment, you know, because, like, I'm humble, so, you know what I'm saying, I keep my composure with everything I do, and uh, when it's just my time to go play, I just, you know what I'm saying, So. it. Are you somebody that sets personal goals at all? Like, did you enter this game saying, I got to get to 100 yards, or I got to get a touchdown, or nah, anything like that? No, nah, it just happened. I let my work take over. It sounds like you're still not satisfied that you didn't score. Though. Is that still sort of a bone? Yeah, I'm upset I didn't score. I should have scored on the one-on-one -on -one I had with the safety. I let him tackle me. Coach Scott going to get on me about that in the, in the uh, running back meetings or whatever. But, yeah, that's the, that, that was a long one right there. I should have got that one. So. The more reps you're getting, is this game slowing down for you? Are you seeing things? that you maybe didn't see before? Yeah, I'm seeing a lot. Like, it's slowing down. Like, me going to the film um, with Coach Scott, you know, going back and forth with it, um, 
learning the pickups, like the blitz pickups and all that, the pro and all that, yeah, it's going like real slow. I gotta, yeah. This probably for a lot of people is just much more fun to watch the offense, right? Scores points, goes up and down, but as a player, the past couple of games, is it more fun to play in? And, and if that's the case, what what's happened to make it enjoyable? Can you repeat that one more time? It seems like you guys are having a lot more fun on mm. offense right now. It was harder early in the season, right? So what is switch where this has become more fun for you guys? Oh, well, we really like put in the work. Like that's all it really is at practice. You know what I'm saying? Um, Coach Brown, Coach Scott, like they with us and they're on us about, you know what I'm saying, what we do at practice. And like we just try to make it possible, you know what I'm saying, like work hard and don't, I don't know. Let up. Not about the way you guys are playing, though. It's a yeah, lot yeah. of movement. It's fast sometimes, too. Is there something about the quality that gets you all going? Uh, I don't know. The energy in the, in the – yeah, energy. I think CJ said earlier this week that sometimes you guys take things from one another. What, what's something that maybe you've taken from his game and you, you can see he's taken from your game? Oh, man. That's a hard one. That's hard. I ain't gonna lie, that's hard. I can't. Oh man. Uh I'll say like for me, me taking well Damn. I don't know. I, I don't know how to put it. Yeah, like we just you know what I'm saying, just different. Yeah. I say you can of the place that you're running here that you're getting the most carries on. What one is the most natural for you? Like, what did you run in high school a lot? And is there one sequence or whatever that you've had to work on to figure out how to run the best? Uh, I like the zone, inside zone, outside zone, uh, counters. Like, I really like it all because, like, getting behind the two big pullers, like, nobody can see me. So, like, once I, you know what I'm saying, once I make my move, uh, yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.